I'm joined now by Curtis McBride with MyoVision. Hi, Curtis. How are you? Great. How are you? Pretty good. So MyoVision is supporting cities. How are they helping the, with the implementation of digital infrastructure? Yeah, so we, we, we really led the way on this idea of the smartphone of the intersection. Um, so we, we think about the intersection as, you know, if we can give you one piece of hardware that can do all the things that you used to have to buy 10 pieces of hardware to do, uh, this is a much more capital efficient, much easier deployment uh, strategy than, you know, the industry's been in for, for 30 years. We kind of led the way on that, uh, that concept. And how is this making city, cities more safe and more efficient? Yeah, I mean, one of the examples would be, um, I'll give you, I'll give you, I'll give you an example of a, a thing called a conflict analysis. So traditionally, when we want to understand cities, we um, we study the co the conflict history. So last ten years, how many crashes happened at this intersection? Okay, wow, this intersection is you know really punching above its weight. A lot of crashes are happening here. Uh, we should fix it. We should do something about it. Uh, with the conflict analysis, you're constantly looking for near misses. So where the crash didn't quite happen, but it almost did, uh, those happen way more frequently than actual crashes. Uh, and this can give us a much more, uh, a much earlier indication of where we might have an unsafe intersection. It's one of the things that we provide cities. Why is reliable data so important for this? I mean, data is becoming, you know, da da data is the new oil. It's been, it's been said, um, data is a, is a super valuable to drive outcomes. Um, you, ca you, can't, you can't improve what you can't measure. Uh, and, and so data is super important. Uh, the data is generated not just from MyAvision, but from lots of different vendors in the industry. Uh, and we're, we believe that as almost like a core value of the industry, uh, we need to really move to a collaboration and interoperability model way more so than we already are in today. Where do you see this industry in the next five to 10 years? I think there's, uh, uh, change is, gonna, is coming. Change is coming to this industry and it's either gonna happen through us or to us. Uh, and I think if we get the, the architecture and the collaboration, the spirit of collaboration right, uh, I think this industry can sort of lead the way on bringing uh, the connected vehicle future into existence. Uh, I do worry that if we don't, if we, if we try to dig our heels in and stay in the 20th century, uh, that someone from outside, you know, big automotive, big tech, uh, is going to come in and make the change for us. Really good information. Thank you so much for joining us, Curtis. Thank you.